UFC 280 returns to Fight Island in Abu Dhabi, Dubai, and these are my predictions for the main card. Caitlin Chukogian vs. Manan Fior Caitlin is ranked number one in the flyweight division and has good defense overall as a fighter. Manan can finish fights and also has great cardio. I think Manan can set the pace for this fight early. Manan is capable of knocking out Caitlyn, but I'm sure Caitlyn knows this going into this fight. I'm sure she was training to counter all her strikes that she is going to throw. I think Caitlyn finishes this fight. I think she's going to fight smart for three rounds and gets the win. I got Caitlyn winning this fight by a decision. Benil Daryush vs. Mateus Gamrat Both of these guys are known for decision wins. Gamrat is the better wrestler and he has 90% takedown defense. I think Benil needs to catch Gamra off guard when striking in order to win. While I think Benil needs to strike and KO his opponent, I don't think he'll win that way. I see a wrestling match for 3 rounds. I got Gamra winning this fight by decision. Piotr Jan vs Sean O'Malley The Sugar Show takes on his hardest opponent yet in Piotr Jan, the former bantamweight champion. Both these guys can box, but Peter is the better wrestler and we haven't seen a whole lot of wrestling from Sean O'Malley yet. As much as I like Sean, I think he's going to get taken down and finished. Sean is tall and fighting a smaller man, similar to the Cheeto Vera fight, his only loss. I think Piotr gets a TKO win. I got Piotr Jan winning this fight by TKO in round number 3. Aljamain Sterling vs TJ Dillashaw, the co-main event of the evening with the bantamweight title on the line. TJ is fighting for the first time since July of 2021. It's been over a year and after a questionable win, he gets a title shot. Sterling is impressive with 50% significant strikes landed, but what I like more is a 71 inch reach advantage compared to TJ's 67 inch. Striking is going to happen, and wrestling for sure, with TJ having an 86% takedown defense. I think this fight will go 5 rounds, and I think at the end of the day, we have the same champion. I got Sterling winning this fight by a decision. Charles Oliveira vs. Islam Makachev, the main event of the evening with the UFC lightweight title on the line. Everybody thinks Islam will out-wrestle Charles, but I think the opposite will happen. Charles is very underrated as a striker, and I think he can KO Islam. I got Charles Oliveira winning this fight by KO in round number 2, similar to the Chandler fight when Charles Oliveira KO Chandler in round number 2 after getting beat in the first round. So these are my predictions for UFC 280, but I want to know what do you guys think? Do you agree with my predictions? What fight are you looking forward to the most? Let me know in the comment section down below. Other than that, I got nothing more to say, and I'll see you in the next video.